Hi, and welcome to this episode of Forkful of Noodles. I am Krish Mohan. <sighs> Feel that? That's the wind on the internet. Wind on the internet is pretty much the same thing like the wind in, in, in reality. You know, the wind has energy. This is something hippies and yoga instructors have been talking about for years. Energy that can do a whole lot, like power an entire city or an entire country. It can be farmed, it can be thrown into windmills, it can be used in terrible animated films that M. Night Shyamalan can then come back and ruin. But the one person that thinks that wind has no potential is Senate Republicans. Recently, they denied an $85 billion tax cut that would have advanced wind energy, helping them advance as a source of clean energy. This is a continued bigger push to use more fossil fuels and support the bigger gas and oil companies out Grace, there. this is absolutely butt fucking insanity is what you know, your liberal agenda is pushing right now. Family show, sir. Tex Texaco. Is that, that's your, that's your whole line up? All right, you know what? Well, I don't want to use my full name, Texaco, Alamo, Beef Heart, Brisket, but yeah, you're insane. Listen, wind energy is completely safe, it's clean, it's a great source of energy. I mean, I feel like you're not giving it enough credit. Are you, are, are, are you, are you shitting me? Clean energy, first of all, starts with the earth. Mother earth, right? You would agree to that? Mother earth makes green energy. Sure. Wind is dangerous, but oil and petrol and all that stuff that used to be old dinosaurs and all that crap, that stuff, that's made by Mother Earth. That's in the Earth. It's good old, dirty, just, just great. Just, just so, so good. Oh, it tastes so good. Okay, that's just insane that you would even consider wind to be a danger. Or, 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 or you, you are completely out of line. Hey, you don't remember a very important film, one of the greatest cinematic triumphs of Bill Paxton, the film Trip Twister, the movie with what? not one but two flying cows. First movie ever to do that. All practical effects. Both those cows died just to make sure that that Helen Hunt lady from that show with the Paul Reiser, Angry About People, I believe mad, it was called. Mad, mad About You. Mad it? About Whatever. Mad about that, 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 that is just, wind is dangerous. It can hurt a lot of people. And you, you're pushing it under your liberal, liberace, bullshit agenda. Liberace? First, first of all, I don't think wind has ever done anything bad to any city in America. Are you, are, are you, are, are you, are you, you're very clearly drunk on liberal bullshit. Because, first of all, there's one little city that got fucked over by wind very, very hard. It's called Katrina. And yes, oil then did also destroy that golf several weeks later. But, it, it was actually, yes. Yeah, wow, yeah, actually, New Orleans is not doing well. No, 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 that, that, no. That, that, that city has not fared well. Nope, it is not. New Orleans... Is not doing, doing well. well. Well, at least we can agree on that. Huh. Yeah. Yeah, we can. Well, okay. Second of all, wind is available everywhere. It's like available in all 50 states. You always can get some sort of tax break, right? Like oil is only available in like a select small number of states that you have to go in and, and frack and there's poison involved and people's water is getting set on fire. I said a fresh mouth is if Krishna, Krishna, let me tell you something. Gas stations in every single 50 state, just like the wind. And tax stations employ people. Wind, all it does is make kites attack people, like F. Scott Fitzgerald. Do you know that? You know he's attacked by a kite? I was not. No, yeah. not aware of that. Fact. Yeah. Do you know a kite one time shocked uh, Benjamin L. Franklin? Do you know that? No, I think it was light. Yeah, okay. yeah. but the wind, the wind put it up there so he got shocked and died. Regardless of whatever fictional thing you think happened to B Benjamin L. Franklin, okay, you you it's can't real. go it's on a coin. Yeah, it's it's happened in happened Philadelphia, Philadelphia, which is a city. I, I feel like Wisconsin, you can't go up there and just start digging for oil up there. You have to go to a specific place that has oil, and Wisconsin is one of the states that doesn't have oil. Henceforth, proving that wrong. You drill for oil, you don't actually dig for it. I just, just want to so just clarify there. I'm sorry to be a, 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 a nebulous Nancy, but uh, you're, yeah, you're no. completely wrong. In fact, you're, your wrongness of your liberal activism has become such a problem that we're going to just go ahead and call it security. Security! 
Security! Someone call for me! What? That's right. This, uh, that? This, this young, <laughs> this young Spanish boy, Nachos Mochanos. Can you, uh, can you get him the hell out of here? Wait, this Dude, guy, come on with me. You come work for me. me. You work for me. Yeah, but I gave him a shitload of money. He got a bunch of new stuff. Yeah, I got like this big bag of money, and he gave me this big box of guns to add to the already big box of guns we gave have. Him a gun? He can't hold yeah. a gun. Oh, he can't now. We're paying him 500 times what he did before. That's awesome. He very clearly does not understand how math works because zero times 500 is. It's not a good deal. Don't worry about that math right now. Just you go off and after you finish, they have big bowl of oil. You forget all about this. Probably because we're killed by Frank Sells. No, the wind energy will be back. You can't silence the rest of this episode is dedicated to all the fallen foes of the wind. The fallen people have been murdered by the wind at some point. Eventually, Mary Poppins, the Bill Kite Key, all the victims of Katrina. Hurricane Andrew, uh, the, the, the Wicked Witch of the East, she was killed by wind. Yes, she was. Uh, uh, that paper dollar man I made in second grade, he blew off into the sunset. Uh, that one Wright brother, uh, Neil Armstrong's second cousin, he wasn't killed by it, but he was maimed by, by a fan when he tried to stick his genitals in. And you know what? If wind wasn't there, it wouldn't be necessary for that fan. It just, he'd have all his genitals intact and he wouldn't even be dead. Uh, uh, Perlman Carter, uh, the woman who uh, invented wind energy and then shocked herself to death. That worked out well for you, Perlman, right? Right? Bye, oil.